Hi everyone, welcome to evening prayer for August 15th. It's Saturday and it's the Solemnity of the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary. And we can find the hymn for evening prayer on page 1648 of the four volume, in volume four, page 1648, and the psalmodies begin on 1649. So, let us begin. O Lord, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Mother of holy hope, and of love everlasting, O oh, pray for us. At the dawn of time, I was known by the Lord, and his command he gave to me. He chose the land where I should establish my tent. Mother of holy hope and of love everlasting, O oh, pray for us. Of a virgin was born Jesus, Lord, whom we pray. Glory and praise be to his name. May every age call his mother holy and blessed. Mother of holy hope and of love everlasting, O oh, pray for us. Mary has been taken up to heaven. The angels rejoice. They bless the Lord and sing his praises. I rejoiced when I heard them say, Let us go to God's house. And now our feet are standing within the gates of Jerusalem. Jerusalem, as a city strong, was built as a city strong and compact. It is there that the tribes go, the tribes of the Lord. For Israel's law it is there to praise the Lord's name. There were set the thrones of judgment of the house of David. For the peace of Jerusalem, pray, peace be to your homes. May peace reign in your walls, in your palaces, peace. For love of my brethren and friends, I say, peace upon you. For love of the house of the Lord, I will ask for your good. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Mary was taken up to heaven. The angels rejoice. They bless the Lord and sing his praises. The virgin was taken up to heavenly bridal chamber, where the king of kings is seated on, the, on his starry throne. If the Lord does not build the house, in vain do its builders labor. If the Lord does not watch over the city, in vain does the watchman keep vigil. In vain is your early rising, your going later to rest. You who toil for the bread you eat, when he pours gifts on his beloved while they slumber. Truly sons are a gift from the Lord, a blessing, the fruit of the womb. Indeed, the sons of Youth are like arrows in the hand of a warrior. Oh, the happiness of a man who has filled his quiver with these arrows. He will have no cause for shame when he disputes with his foes in the gateways. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. The Virgin Mary was taken up to the heavenly bridal chamber, where the King of Kings is seated on a starry throne. We share the fruit of life through you, O daughter blessed by the Lord. Praise be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, who has bestowed on us in Christ every spiritual blessing in the heavens. God chose him in us, and therefore the world began to be holy and blameless in his sight. He predestined us to be his adopted sons through Jesus Christ. Such was his will and pleasure that all might praise the glorious favor he has bestowed on us in his beloved. In him and through his blood we have been redeemed, and our sins forgiven, so immeasurably generous is God's favor to us. God has given us the wisdom to understand fully the majesty, the plan he has pleased, he was pleased, to decree in Christ. 
a plan to be carried out in Christ in the fullness of time, to bring all things into one in Him, in the heavens and on the earth. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. We share the fruit of life through you, O daughter, blessed by the Lord. Just as in Adam all die, so in Christ all will come to life again, that each one in proper order, Christ the first fruits, and then, at his coming, all those who belong to him. The Virgin Mary is exalted above the choirs of angels. Blessed is the Lord who has raised her up above the choirs of angels. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Virgin Mary is exalted above the choirs of angels. Today the Virgin Mary was taken up to heaven. Rejoice, for she reigns with Christ forever. My soul proclaims the greatness of the Lord. My spirit rejoices in God, my Savior, for he has looked with favor on his lowly servant. From this day all generations will call me blessed. The Almighty has done great things for me, and holy is his name. He has mercy on those who fear him in every generation. He has shown the strength of his arm. He has scattered the proud in their conceit. He has cast down the mighty from their thrones and has lifted up the lowly. He has filled the hungry with good things, and the rich he has sent away empty. He has come to the help of his servant Israel, for he has remembered his promise of mercy, the promise he made to our fathers, to Abraham and his children forever. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Today the Virgin Mary was taken up to heaven. Rejoice, for she reigns with Christ forever. Let us pray God, our Almighty Father, who wished that Mary, his son's mother, be celebrated by each generation. So now, in need, we ask him, O oh God, miracle, worker of miracles, you made the Immaculate Virgin Mary share body and soul in your Son's glory in heaven. Direct the hearts of your children to that same glory. You made Mary our mother through her intercession, grant strength to the weak, comfort to the sorrowing, pardon to sinners, salvation and peace to all. You made Mary full of grace. Grant all men the joyful abundance of your grace. Make your church of one mind and one heart in love. And help all those who believe to be one in prayer with Mary, the mother of Jesus. You crowned Mary, Queen of Heaven. May all the dead rejoice in your kingdom with saints, with the saints forever. Now we pray as Jesus taught us to pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done. On earth as it is in heaven, give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O oh God, who, looking on the lowliness of the Blessed Virgin Mary, raised her to this grace, that your only begotten Son was born of her according to the flesh, and that she was crowned this day with surpassing glory. Grant through her prayers that, saved by the mystery of your redemption, we may merit to be exalted by you on high. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. And may the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. 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 God bless you. Have a wonderful evening. If it is his wish, 
we will wake to serve him again tomorrow. God be with you.